Hello everybody. Today we're headed to Costco um, with the good old Melon King. And Natalie's coming with us today. So she said she wanted to be in the vlog. We're gonna do a solid run. Today's run, there's actually gonna be a little bit more than just Costco. Um, Cause I do have to go to Ulta and do a pickup for some of this tanner. Um, because we're going on a trip. We are doing a full Costco run today. And I also do have to go to Sally's. I need some uh, leave-in conditioner. <laughs> Natalie's excited. I had planned on tanning a little bit, which I know is so bad for you, don't do it. But my skin has not seen sun in seven months. Like, not even like a little bit, okay? Um, the sun has hit my face and it just now started to get warm. In January, when the sun hits you, uh, it's cold. There's no heat to it. So I had planned on tanning, but I don't think I'm gonna make it. Life is just expensive, okay? And tanning is crazy. Anyways, so we're doing a little bit of a shopping trip today. The rest of the kids are in school and we are this is gonna be a big run. Because of stuff we have going on, it's going to be a lot of convenience foods. So if you're wondering what we get for that, <laughs> lots of snacks, lots of kid-friendly stuff. We're back down to, to some cold weather. Not super cold, we're about 10 below, and I am thankful for that it's not 40 below, but man, that felt really cold after some 30 and 40 degrees for a little while. That is what we call fool's spring. <laughs> It's like, it's like the spring when it warms up and you're like, oh, this is what warmth feels like. And then it shoots back down to 10, 20, even 30 below. So that's all right. Lance did get some more fuel put into our tank here. So we are topped off, ready to go. All right, I'm just rambling. Ah, let's go head to Costco and do some shopping. change of plans. Uh, of course Lance was starving, so we're going to food factory to get some lunch with her girl. Lunch was fantastic as always at Food Factory. Um, I didn't vlog a whole ton there, but we're at Ulta, as you can see, tiny, um, just to pick up my sunless tanner. And I think there's supposed to be a free gift with it, which was kind of cool. Also, Natalie wants to shop around, so for a little bit. We don't have a ton of time. We have about, actually about two and a half hours. Dang, we don't have a ton of time. Costco normally takes us like two hours because we wander and I'm vlogging and it's just a good time. All right, let's go into Ulta. Hey, Got it. <laughs> He's embarrassed. Oh, I'm vlogging so in public. Different out here. We're, we're on ice. Pressure. <laughs> Is a little snack. Hold on. I'm serious. I'm in the bottle. All right. Yeah. Sally's has this generic brand. It's supposed to be the It's a 10 Miracle Leave In Conditioner. This is really good. I got the Biolage. Let me put my seatbelt on. Night, woman. I'm trying to keep you around. <laughs> Such bad lighting. That's awful angles. You're mad about the sun right now? <laughs> I'm not mad. I'm just trying not to blind everybody. Look out, I'm like ghostly. All right, I tried out the, the they have their generic version in the Biolage Color Blast. I think I vlogged it actually. I really didn't like it. The smell was there, it smelled like it, but the, it was very heavy, unlike the Biolage. I just didn't really care for it. Natalie actually really liked it, so she ended up using it. This leave-in conditioner is amazing. It's been many years since I've tried the It's a 10, so I don't know if it compares, but just as a leave-in conditioner, I love this one. And then I'm gonna be dyeing my hair. 
here in about a week. So I got one of the, it's like a Malibu, but it's a Sally's version. These are $3.59 and it removes all the buildup on your hair. Works great right before I dye it. Right there. I, oh, Jess, I've already seen it. Okay, I see it. <laughs> you're, you're not gonna drive around the parking lot a couple times just to make sure. Oh! What? I don't do that, do I? <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> I'm not perfect, but I'm close. You, Is that turned on? Yeah. Is it filming? It's filming. <laughs> it's videotaping us. Videotapes. Videotapes. All right. Here's the game plan. We're going in. We're sticking to the list. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I've seen your list and I don't like it. It's really long. I don't like it at all. We stopped at Sunrise and got some coffees. Brought you in part by. <laughs> Today's video is sponsored by... My wallet. Sunrise Bagel and Espresso. Your wallet. <laughs> he gets a white chocolate mocha. Super basic white. Um, <laughs> white chocolate mocha. Okay, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> I get, uh, as always, a white chocolate Americano with cream. Um, the that difference- That is not Americano. Huh? What'd you order me? <laughs> oh no. You ordered me a white mocha? Oh. You are in so much trouble. Just kidding. It's a white mocha. You ordered a white mocha? Half-calf. Okay. It okay. is half-calf. In my defense, you were like, hey, just get a little bigger one. And I was like, well, I get white chocolate mocha. I thought you knew that. So I'm like. I knew that, but then I was like, no, I'll just get one. It's fine. I normally get a white chocolate Americano. My boyfriend knows what my coffee order. <laughs> Dave. <laughs> Dave? Who's Dave? <laughs> That's the new one. We've switched from Michael to Dave. Oh, okay. Oh, there's another shorts wear. Yeah, there's always it's one. It's five below zero. We've seen two people in shorts. There's always those. And okay. she was freaking out about me wearing no coat yeah you're putting your coat on for costco mm. middle schoolers okay normally i get a white chocolate americano this is half calf so it's half decaf half regular and then he gets a white mocha he got fully loaded it's two o'clock i probably won't sleep tonight and landon has ivig tomorrow so <sighs> this is turning into a coffee vlog but um the difference between an americano and a mocha is they use milk as the base in a mocha and then an americano is water-based and then i add a little bit of half and half so it's like it's still creamy it still tastes like a white chocolate mocha but you don't get so much milk mm -hmm. i'm not sure i should be trusted drinking caffeine before we go into costco oh no, you should. gosh should be zooming yeah, you got marijuana products <laughs> <laughs> marijuana <laughs> we show the vlog Marijuana, apparently. It's the hemp's lotion. I don't know if you can see that very well. It's kind of it's shiny. Kind of looks, like a, looks like a failed drug test to me. <laughs> <laughs> He's kidding. Let's go over the list one more time. Let's shorten it out. Oh, we'll probably end up adding. Are you done here? Okay. Uh, yeah. Nope. I guarantee you we could just not go in here today and we're still going to be alive next week. <laughs> We've got Go-Gurt, eggs, Lunchables, string cheese, berries, like blueberries, strawberries, okay. Uncrustables, chicken nuggets, corn dogs, tater tots, pizza, lasagna, gr frozen green beans, fruit cups, fruit snacks, granola bars, popcorn, gluten-free bread, regular bread, jelly, microwave rice, and squeeze packs. Oh. Okay, you're under 300. I know it ain't less than 300. No, she's under 600, hopefully. Huh? <laughs> I bet it's going to be 500. I'm going to guess 550. What it's going to be guess, 400. Right. What's your guess, Dad? I'm going to guess 550. Do the workers get discounts? 405. I don't know. About to get a part time job at Costco. Let's go. <laughs> okay, let's go to Costco. So glad she put her coat on, not with her sleeves. So, so glad. I said to put my coat on. So teenager.
we're not off to a great start for healthy foods, that's for sure. It's just pure junk at this point, so things will get better, okay? Clothes were not on the list. These were only $20. Little Puma shoes. Sweet. Middle Perfect school approved. Perfect camper shoes too. Oh, that's true. Oh, I can wear my house shoes right now because I have two tennis shoes already. <laughs> I'll buy it. Yeah. Not right now. Okay. Alaska Home Pass. Support local at Costco. Yeah. It just disappeared one day. Sus. Gone. Okay. Lance the leprechaun. The leprechaun. <laughs> <laughs> Give me one more. What? Oh, I missed it. Can you do one more? <laughs> okay. You're, you're on the last <laughs> that last one was pulled thing. <laughs>
buffalo boneless chicken bites. Okay. Adult chicken nuggies. <laughs> Spicy. Onion dip. Oh. All the onion dip. All the groceries take your guess on what the total is <laughs> i know what it was <laughs> i know exactly <laughs> a lot thanks for taking the cart back yeah. it is colder than i want it to be right now <sighs> uh. we are doing good today oh my gosh look at all these carts these were not us they're everywhere all right guys it's many, many hours later. The kids are already in bed, <laughs> but we are done. It was a big run. I ended up running into a friend towards the end and um, chatting for a second. And then we had to like rush and get the kids. So it didn't end up vlogging a whole lot more. We got such a wide variety of stuff today. Uh, we didn't go in there for any type of clothes. I showed those slacks and I tried them on and they're so comfortable. They're not like a super nice fancy slack, I would say. They're more of like a casual, if you had like business casual maybe a little bit. Um, but I love them so much. They're super stretchy. It almost feels like you have leggings on, like very stretchy fabric. Love them. Lance's pants were, he got the size he normally wears, but they were way too big for him. So he's gonna go return those, get a smaller size because I think the pants will look good if they're just a little bit smaller. And then we got Addie some shirts. A lot of their clothes were just on sale today. And so we kind of glanced through most times we go in there just to see what kind of deals we can get. And they had some crazy deals. I got those slacks for $10, $9.97. So when he goes in tomorrow, I told him to look for the black ones. Maybe they'll like restock them because I would prefer to have the black ones. The ones I got have, they, they look black, but they have kind of a pattern on them and it's a nice pattern. I don't have to dress up nicely very often, but it'd be nice to have them for like meetings with the school or, you know, just to just a little bit nicer, but it was a lot of fun today. It was fun that Natalie came along because if you have a middle schooler age, you know they're most of the time homebodies. <laughs> and so I kind of have to like pry around the house, like, hey, let's go, let's go here, come with me here. And so she was really excited about going to Costco today. It was just all over a good time having her around. I love having my kids around. And so she got to enjoy some mom and dad time alone with her. All right, I'm gonna end this one, but the total for today was 505.43. Now we did have clothes in there and it was a whole lot of convenience foods. So I'm not super shocked at that price because I knew we were buying some easier foods, but 
that is it. All right, guys, thank you for coming along in this Costco haul. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, and we will see you in the next video. Bye!